It had been 11 long years since these Bochum supporters could celebrate a home game in the top flight. And facing minds with their coach, Bo Svensson, the Bochum head coach, Thomas Reis, finished last season as second division champions and was confident coming into this contest. And what a start it turned out to be. Gerrit Holtman, a former Mainz player, decided to take the initiative just over 20 minutes into the game and taking on the whole defence from Mainz. No one was able to stop him. And neither the goalkeeper, Robin Sentner, his fourth Bundesliga strike, and what a strike he'll never forget for Holtman. Well, the home side thought they got a second. Simon Sola, who scored 15 goals in Bundesliga 2 to help promotion, denied by Robin Sentner with a brilliant save. And a minute later again, Sola involved from a Milos Pantovic corner, and the Bochum crowd thought they were in dreamland, but more like a nightmare when the goal had to be disallowed for handball. Correct decision. Just short of half-time, Mainz grew in confidence and 25-year-old Nicholas Tower saw his wonderful effort going in but keeper Manuel Riemann's quick reactions and left toe cleared the danger. Gerrit Holtman's heroics and flash of brilliance separating the two teams at half-time. But Borkham did get a second goal 11 minutes into the half and that was courtesy of new signing Sebastian Polter who shielded himself to pounce on Simon Zoller's excellent cross. 2-0, Borkum. Mainz never stopped trying, but Borkum were always trying that little bit harder. Two big Mainz attacks with 10 minutes remaining. Kevin Sturger, the substitute, was also stopped by keeper Riemann. And in the same minute, another Mainz substitute, Adam Charloy, was also unable to break down the Borkum defence. Over 4,000 days since the last Bundesliga home match was well worth the wait for their supporters. Borkum 2, Mainz 0.